Hi everyone and welcome to another tech tip brought to you by Coric Group. In this tip I will show you how to create a section box um, in Feelink uh, by using uh, elevation range. So once you have your model in to uh, Feelink, so this is a model brought in from Tecla from Steel. So if I wanted to just uh, say isolate this section, so if I'm only working with this upper deck and this section of the model okay i can actually go down to the zipper menu and you'll see that there's a little box there okay so this is a, a limit box so like a section box so i'll open up a box and you hit add and what it does is it creates these little pull bars all around the model okay so if i go over and select the red piece i can select that drag it down so now i have a floor and a half so if i want to get into full handrail if i want to edit that to change the name i can just call it a uh, floor floor level ground level one just with stairs and it'll give me a top elevation and a bottom elevation but if i say oh i just want to work at a certain elevation if I don't want to go that high, I know the floor is at a certain elevation. I can key it in and go 3.5, hit save, and then it dropped down. So you can see the handle coming down a little bit. So if I come down a little bit more, I can go back in and edit that. And you see it's gone down to top elevation 705. So I can go to 0.6, hit save. And there you go, it's down to 0.6. Once that's done, I can just unselect my limit box and I'm uh, willing to work away in that model. Okay, so you can create as many section boxes as you want and they're really easy uh, to select. And if I click the box again, I can go back to my main view and back into my floor and a half. Okay, thank you. Bye.